So it's a beautiful Sunday morning here at the Swan Dolphin Resort in between Epcot and Hollywood Studios. I think I had my fill of uh, Universal yesterday enough so because I mean it's kind of... Uh, I don't know, it's kind of a hassle driving there. And, uh, I'm, I couldn't find the rental Jeep Cherokee last night. Looked and looked. I cannot believe it. Nothing like that has ever happened to me before. I think I was so determined and fixed. I look at the sign and rehearsed it a few times. But then I thought I was in the parking garage that I'd already parked that I always parked in in the past when going there a few times and I was in the other parking garage how embarrassing a kind gentleman and I was wore out and couldn't look anymore a kind gentleman maintenance worker there let me ride around in the golf cart for with me with him and we found it finally so it was already dark by then because I did I did have a desire to see Universal at night. I do uh, Islands of Adventure at night. I do enjoy that at night. They were open till 9 p.m. So it would have been like hour and a half of darkness. But oh well. Hopefully I'll get a chance to ride the uh, the Sky Tram Liner again. I rode it the first when I first got here and took a video, but. I did not get it right. It was sideways. So, anyway, have had fun. It's been a smooth trip. Spectacular and awesome and epic. But I'm, I'm starting to realize and come to find that I like the, uh, the more local trips that I take. I enjoy those more. Not that I won't come back here again, but uh, trips to Wisconsin Dells and Burlington, Iowa. And, of course, French Lick, Indiana, and Southern Indiana, the Hoosier National Forest. I, I think, actually, I enjoy those more. And, and uh, you know, like midway between those trips and a trip like this would be Gatlinburg, Tennessee, which, i got to admit, there's some folksiness and wholesomeness there. The, the, everything here is just so choreographed, and that's fine. I get it. You know, you're not going to find a vending machine or a soda machine in this hotel. You're just not. If you end up like I did the other night and just got back just barely in time to get a meal to go at a restaurant there. The restaurant closed at 11. I got back Friday night at 10.45. But I got back in time and I was able to get some food. Otherwise, I don't know what I would have done. So, but I mean, I know that they plan everything accordingly and do what's most optimal in every regard anyway last night i did ride the boat my phone was dead so i didn't take it with it was a nice pleasant trip i was wore out i am interested in seeing the sky tram liner at night but i rode the boat that docked over here and on the other side of that walkway there look you can't see the the sphere from here my room is on the other side of this, but it'd be like on the corner there, overlooking the boardwalk. Looks like they have some pretty cool rooms over along the boardwalk. I like that area. So it was a nice boat ride. There's quite a line for the Sky Tram right next to it, right near the, uh, the, the other entrance to Epcot, not the main one. And uh, so anyway, the plan for today is Epcot opens at 11. I might have to drive a little ways just to hit a convenience store. No big deal. But for the most part, I'm going to stay pretty close to this area today and tomorrow. Today, Epcot, and tomorrow, Hollywood, and Galaxy's Edge. Which, that's quite a feat, because some theorists say that the galaxy is like ever-expanding. So, there are places in this universe that if you have the ability longevity of life and the technology and the speed 
there are places in this universe you never get to because it's expanding. As you leave, it's going faster than you are. But you say, well, wait. If, you, you know, going to the moon or Mars, that's not changing. Well, that's because that's too small of an area. It's not detectable. But you would really, really get out there and branch out. You would see that the infinite universe is expanding yet now. How is that possible? Wrap your mind around that. It goes on and on forever, but it's expanding. I'm going to the galaxy's edge tomorrow is the plan. My big B day. I'm loving it. Good times.